Hi, in this video, we will see install Eclipse in Mac machine. Okay, so what is Eclipse? Eclipse is one of the ideas to write Java code. Means if you want to develop Java applications, you need to write the code, right? Where you will write the code. So for that, we will use IDEs, we will use online editors, we will use some text editors that we have seen in our one of the previous videos, right? So where you will write the Java code? So in these environments, you can write, but IDE is best option that if you are developing a big application, you want so many third party things or so many shortcuts or so many uh, intelligence, all these things. So everything can be available means out of the box in Eclipse. So because of that, not only Eclipse with the IDEs, so Eclipse is one of them. So we will see how you can install Eclipse in your Mac machine. So let's go to the Mac machine. So this is my Mac machine here in the Google, just search install Eclipse. Okay, the first link, you see that Eclipse installer, you just click on this from the eclipse.org. So here you can get the download, you see that Mac, Windows and Linux. Okay, Mac, Windows, and Linux. You will have so many flavors. You don't bother about all those things. You just download this, install your favorite desktop ID packages, get a Eclipse ID. Otherwise you can just click on here X86. It will go to this link and you need to download. You see that it's DMG. And this is an open source, completely open source tool. So I'll just download this. So they're asking us to donate something. Okay. You can donate from $5 to $100 according to your interest. Okay. It is downloading the DMG. So once it is done, we'll try to install this Eclipse. Yeah, it's done. Let me open this. Yeah, you see that DMG. Okay. So just double click on this. You see that you will find Eclipse installer. Just double click on this. It's verifying Eclipse installer. Eclipse installer is an app downloaded from the internet. Are you want? Are you sure you want to open it? So you can go ahead and click on open. No problem. Now in the back end, you see that Eclipse installer. It will take some time. And one of the prerequisites for this, okay, Java should be installed in your machine. Now you'll have a different type of options, which kind of Eclipse you want to Install Eclipse ID for Java developers, enterprise Java and web developers, C, C++ developers, something like that. So we are interested in the first one, Eclipse ID for Java developers is enough. Once you click on that, you see that install. Okay, the Java is detected in this location, JDK 17.0.1, and the installation folder is users and your user slash Eclipse slash your version. So just click on install. Java to 2021. So it is asking us to accept the license agreement. Just accept now. Now it will download, means it will install now. So it will take some time. So 
so now it is done it took some time i paused the video in between so but uh, it's done you see that after that it is asking me to launch so we'll try to launch and see you see the eclipse id 2021 5.12. So it is also will take some time. So Eclipse will be a bit slow. So it will take some time to load all these things. You see that? Now it is asking me the what is the workspace. So it will give you some default location. If you want, you can change. But now I'll just click on this launch. So it is loading. eclipse will take some time when you open and when you close so this is the first look of eclipse id so welcome to the eclipse id for java developers you will have so many options create a hello world application create a new java project check out the projects from the git something like that okay let me go back to here so import existing projects so some options will be there this is welcome screen if you don't whenever you open it you can see this one you see always show welcome at startup i don't want okay just i'll close this then you can see this view in the left side you'll have a package explorer here you can create a project here in this area where i'm moving my mouse here you'll write the code okay so we'll see about this eclipse and how you will use we'll see in the upcoming videos but here this is how you can download and install eclipse in your mac machine okay so what could be the possible interpretations most of the times nobody will ask so how to get eclipse in your machine and which version of eclipse you are using nobody will ask but if somebody asks you can explain the same thing okay so that's all in this video thank you